Wish you were here. Well, the front's all done. Now it's time to move the scaffolding around the back and get that done. Well, guys and gals, we're all done, thankfully. Some of the shingles need to get warmed up in the sun so they'll lay down a little bit better. But yeah, I'm happy and glad it's done. My legs are sore and I'm tired. It's starting to get chilly. It's the end of the day and it's clouding over up here. I waited till afternoon time probably about 1.30 before I started because it was very cold this morning in the 30s and it finally warmed up to about 50 around 1 and 1.30 so that's when I came out to finish this off. So now I can go on to doing the really fun stuff, the finish work. Some of you might be interested in how I made my scaffolding. You saw the brackets I had on the front and I just took a couple of them, brought them around the back, and nailed them to either corner. And uh, I just used my ladder in the middle, a little bit taller than what I got the other things up to, but it worked fine. I uh, have a brace down here that's tied into the back wall, and another block that I had behind my plank. And my plank is a homemade deal that will come apart quite easily. Uh, it's just two eight foot two by fours with a piece of OSB tacked on top of it. And I say tacked, it's only got three nails on each side. And uh, it's plenty stiff enough, only being eight feet long. Two by four carries my weight, 190 pounds with no problem on edge like that. So now I could take it apart and these will end up being shelving brackets, I'm sure, inside the shed. That's what I have planned anyway. So that's it for today. It's going on six o'clock. Time for me to pick up my tools and go in. Site cleanup is next before we do anything more. It's a mess. Yes, it's a mess. Bye now.